Hi, hi, it's Joey Reynolds here with the Reynolds Wrap, and I can't believe that the President of the United States will not ad admit that he lost the election. I mean, we know there's 70 million people uh, who voted for him, and God bless all of you and, and him, too. But, you know, uh, I don't like what happened at the Super Bowl. So what? You know, you got to get over it. Uh, we're going to have to use the jaws of life to get rid of this guy. And I, I think also uh, we, we got to pr probably use this, grab him by the balls and take him, uh, uh, give him a little big boy lesson. It's unbelievable. And Giuliani, I, you know better, you're Italian, Italian-American Catholic guy, and uh, you're waiting for an Ave Maria, a Hail Mary pass. Get going, you. <laughs> you know, I got one word for Giuliani. <laughs> Come on. Uh, there's only one thing we all care about right now besides making a living and having some money would be the thing I have, the vaccine. See, I, I, I know people. <laughs> I'm, I'm the, listen, when you have a drug dealer with cocaine and heroin and all the other stuff, that guy knows how to get around. And, and he certainly, uh, Pfizer's no big deal for him. We've had a lot of that. How, how easy was it to get the, uh, the, what was that company that used to make the Valiums and the and the uh, Quaaludes? Yeah, that was it, the Ludes. Oh, wow, do we have Ludes? We had them coming out of our nose. I uh, had other things going in our nose. But, you know, that's, this is what killed uh, Wolfman Jack. Do you remember him? Wolfman Jack on the radio. Hey, baby. Uh, you know what killed him? He was a very good friend. Uh, he had a pillbox, and in the pillbox he had Monday through Sunday, and every day had different mix of pills of something unique. The Valium, the Quaaludes, which I mentioned. He had the, uh, we didn't have meth, and we didn't have a heating kit, but he had a pill for every single day of the week. And what happened was he died because he mixed Monday with Saturday. You're not supposed to mix your drugs. You want some of this? <laughs> Give me a network show. <laughs> now, this is how you screw up all those network executives that are sitting there not, not giving older people jobs because they want to have the youth, the young people who sit there and don't know shit. That's what's going on. You know, I mean, we you talk about elder abuse. The elder abuse is really simple. IBM, for instance, just recently, it's been revealed in a class action suit they got rid of everybody systematically after a certain age, like 50, 55, you know, the speed limit. And they sent people home and they and they replaced them with young people because they, well, first of all, you can tell young people what to do. Uh, they, they got a longer life, uh, less pay, less benefits, I guess, uh, less, less of everything. I don't know what the hell, what the reason they don't want to hire older people for. We got a, a president that's 78 years old you got, we just hired an older guy <laughs> and we've hired enough black people. We met our quota <laughs> and got enough women in place now. So what the hell are you talking about? Give me a TV show and you can have the vaccine. I want to be on the air with a regular show doing what I'm doing right here. Never mind Fox, which is that Murdoch uh, scandalized uh, company. Uh, they, uh, let's not even go into that. Uh, and never mind CNN, even, which was, uh, it was really good when Ted Turner made it into a news network. Now it's into a, a party line, you know. I mean, I, I just, give me a show. <laughs> I'll, give, I'll share, I'll share my, I'll share my vaccine. It's a Reynolds wrap.